Andrew McCart, IFL TV in association with MTK Global. I'm here with the new WBO European middleweight. How does that sound, mate? Oh, it's just been a, been a while coming, you know, and uh, it's here now on the new. Uh, just buzzing, just beats us. Uh, delighted, uh, delighted to show my true worth, you know. Um, I've been doing it as the lads always said, Shane, I'm, uh, I'm doing it day, day and day out. It was just about doing it on the season now, and I did, and it was my sort of coming out fight, and uh, almost upwards. Good stuff, eh? Uh, you dropped him in the first round. Was it easy in there for you? Did you find it quite? Uh, you know, it's it's as I said. I was, you know, I was actually I was boxing at the top level as an amateur. I didn't think feel I was showing that as a pro. It was like, it was too tense and just you know, trying to be relaxing and I finally did relax tonight and full confidence in my ability and uh, just was relaxed, sharp, used my job. I took my time, set it up. He showed my skill and it did. And uh, when I hit any of these guys with them horse hard gloves, it's. Uh, I don't know, but well, now you've obviously got this belt. That's you've got the the top fifteen ranking with the WBO yeah. uh, governing body. You're only two good wins away from possibly being top ten and then putting your name in that. Yeah. Up there with the top ones, guys. How's that? That sounds great. You know, my, my dream always to be the world champion. Me, me and my team, you know, that's what we're aiming for. Um, obviously, I'm a while away from that, but I'm taking one fight at a time. But City almost upwards. Uh, a couple of fights, and with, you know, who knows? We could who be knows? right up there. Did, does this make up for the the Ronnie Mittag loss? You know does what? That Mittag, you know, it was due to fight in rematch, and it was very, you know, it was very yeah, motivated for that fight. Uh, you know, I definitely won the first fight. I don't care, but it was a blind man. Could have seen him won the fight. Uh, didn't get the decision. You know, maybe the, the best thing. People, people doubt me. Things, you know, say things. But anyway, um, moving on now. We had the rematch. He pulled out, and uh, the lady in my team stepped up, got me a massive opportunity. W European title. World rank now and uh, just a little. So what's next? When can we see you out next to defend that belt? <laughs> next week. <laughs> next week. You're ready, you're ready. Nice easy two rounds. So you're ready to go. Yeah, I'm only only warmed up. Uh, so uh, whatever. Um, oh, but I'd love to get a one at home. I think I think me and my support uh, are due one at home. And Carl is obviously. Yo-ho! Uh, the main Mike, get him, get him, I'm just talking about you. Hopefully, hopefully he's defending home. It'll be a dream come true to have a big defence at home. We gave me more before them, and uh, we're coming home with the belt. Yes, so one last question: You've got to speak about your gym mate Josh there. What do you what do you think about tonight? Uh, well, Josh, you know, well he's a man. You know, he's world class talent. Uh, she, you know, he's he's full, he's tremendous talent, and he's going to win the night. Uh, he's going to win well. I don't think this guy will do four or five rounds, but uh, I hope he does. I hope he gives him five or six. But uh, he'll defend his belt tonight, and. Uh, He's got a big, big feature in personal boxing. Well, thanks for doing this for IFL TV, mate. Enjoy the night. Thank you. That's what I'm saying.